The non-conference slate continues for number one ranked North Dakota State making their first trip to Delaware and meeting up with a Blue Hens team the Bison demolished in the Fargo Dome one year ago. Now Delaware, they would strike first in this game, blocking a punt for a safety, but NDSU would respond on the ensuing drive. Michael Tutsi with his third pick in the last two weeks. This sets NDSU up with good field position and the Bison would cash it in. True freshman Kobe Johnson diving across the goal line to give the Bison the 7-2 lead. That's a first career touchdown for the Georgia native. After the team's trade field goals, it's now 10-5 NDSU in the second quarter. Trey Lance on third and long goes with the screen pass to Adam Cofield, who gets not only the first down, he gets the touchdown as well, pushing the lead to two scores. Right before the half, the Bison increased their lead. Lance with some misdirection, and then he spots a wide open Ben Ellison in the end zone. 27 to 5 NDSU at the break. They would make it 33 to 5 early in the third quarter with Lance finding another one of his receiving tight end threats. That's Noah Gindorf putting NDSU firmly in control and the bison improved to three and zero oh on the season 47 22 the final score lance with another three passing touchdowns 18 completions to 10 different receivers head coach matt entz after the game the statement i made to our kids is there's plenty of room to get better the, the, the team in that room i'm super excited that we won uh but there were some errors we we, we could have won better and uh i told them if you have a tough time dealing with my expectations then that's tough, but uh, that's the expectations at NDSU, and those are my expectations as well.